The ladies love Meta Beef Cake. Huh? What on earth is he wearing? <laughs> Just a few little arrow parts I threw together myself. The wings I understand, but dude, is this beak really necessary? The beak is the icing on the cake. We have reached a new low point in aviation history. All right, let's get this show off the ground. That sounds like my cue. Are you completely sure that you want to go through with this? Yes. Yeah! It's all for the best. Okay, then. Meta Fighters ready! Row battle! Meta B, take to the air! Get up! No! You need to gain more altitude! Here goes nothing! You got it! Wait, if Femjet hasn't budged, then the main heat source around here is... Femjet ceased! The winner is Femjet! It's unusual to see a row battle where the winner didn't move an inch. I'll say, I couldn't even bring myself to snap a picture. You've acquired arrow parts! Um, we'll pass. Hmm, I should have used more tape on the wings. Eggy! Ha! What are you it's trying to do, Sucker? Come tape on, Femjet, let's it's fly! Not sure! The rubber robos? <laughs> <laughs> Leave her alone! We've been searching for a special Metabot, and I think we found it. We've never seen such an amazing feat of skill before. Yeah, imagine defeating an opponent without so much as blinking. It can only be the work of a rare man. Ready and release! Yes, <laughs> rude and effective. <laughs> See you now! Los amigos! You won't get too far! Pulling off this job was easier than I thought it would be. A little too easy. Don't be a spoil sport, Squid Guts. The rare metal is ours. On board. They don't give up easy, but we still got a few tricks up our sleeves. Dragonfly, attack! Quit shouting! Dragonfly, specialty, shooting attack. Do something before he comes around again! You got it! Bring it on, my guys! Enemy, look out! Uh oh Ah! No problem! Uh, how is Metabee supposed to fight back if he can't even fly? If only we had proper arrow parts! I have an arrow part. Huh? Well, why didn't you say so earlier? Because I still have more testing to do. Uh. I'm transporting it now, but it's a new design, and I'm not even certain that it works. Wow! All right, Metabee, it's time to fire up the engines and take it out on a trial run. Oh, yeah! I feel the need for speed! It's working! A functional arrow part is only half the battle, I'm afraid. Metabee still needs to learn how to control it. You could be more supportive, you know. Come on, Metabee! You can do it! Easy for you to say! Metabee, use your arms and legs for balance and don't ease up on the thruster or you won't have the speed to maintain forward momentum! Oh, so now you want to train me? Well, it'll have to be a crash course! <laughs> we, the evil Rubber Robo Gang, your humble servants, Offer you this gift of a rare metal. Silver. Ouch! That is no rare metal. You failed me. Oh no! He's right on our tail. Ah! 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 Icky! Ah! Ah! You don't have 
have to sound so surprised. What? You grab Femjet while I deal with the pest problem. Huh? Ah! Good luck, ah! Iggy! Ah! Oh! Oh! Later, dude! Hey, wait up! You want a dog fight, sucker? You got it! Mistake. Thank you, Metabi. Now that's a headline. What do you mean you won't wear the beak? Wearing these wings is bad enough. It's not my fault Dr. Aki took back his experimental arrow parts. Then whose fault is it? Will Phantom Renegade make another try for Metabi's rare metal? Will Sea Slug be forced to attend Driver's Ed class? Find out next time on Metabox. Today's row battle, Metabi acquires shooting arm from Dragonfly. More Metabox, more power.
agree. Once you've tried Natalie's octopus balls, you'll never go back. I'll take one. Me too. Me! Over here! How rude, letting your stomach rumble like that in front of a lady. Lady? Who's that? Behind you. So hungry. I think my stomach's starting to eat itself. Hmm? That smell! What? Even ladies get gas. No, not that smell. Ugh! Icky! <sighs> that cart! What is it? <gasps> Octopus balls! That's right. The only thing Icky likes better than row battles is eating octopus balls. See, boss? Told you these octopus balls are the best you'll ever taste. And I've tasted lots of food. Good. Step right up. Get them while they're hot. Ah! What's with those guys? Hi there. Try one on the house. One taste and I'm sure you'll agree. Once you try Natalie's octopus balls, you'll never go back. So, what do you say? Sure, I'll try one. Great. Octoclam, keep them coming. These customers are hungry. Octoclam. Specialty, wind attack. He does the cooking? Octoclam here is my partner. When it comes to cooking, he's the best in Japan. Whoa. Eureka, do yourself a favor and try one. Well, I guess if you put it that way... Sure, why not? Wowee! The crisp yet delicate batter coating with a soft, smooth interior that melts in your mouth. The delectable sweet and sour sauce with just a hint of ginger. And the coup de grace, a generous portion of rich, juicy octopus meat just waiting to tantalize the senses. This is truly a ball de résistance. <laughs> you betcha! My octopus balls are the best in the world! Each one contains an extra large chunk of premium octopus. Hey, Icky, what do you think? Aren't they awesome? The octopus. The chunk is too big. Excuse me. Here we go again. Icky's quest for the perfect octopus balls. <laughs> Don't listen to him. He's such a connoisseur. There isn't an octopus ball in Japan that would satisfy him. The size of the huh? chunk is important, but a chunk this big sacrifices the taste of the smooth batter for a larger piece of meat. You don't know what you're talking about. I'm from Osaka, where we like big chunks. Sorry, but this isn't Osaka. Huh? I'm the authority on octopus balls in this town, and I say your chunks are just too big. Really? What makes you so sure? Because an octopus ball is like the Earth. Huh? Ideally, an octopus ball should be proportionate to the layers of the Earth. Think of the outer shell as the Earth's crust, the inner batter as the Earth's mantle, and the octopus meat as the Earth's core. But if the core were too big, the added pressure would cause the Earth to explode. <gasps> well, that's exactly what you're doing. Your oversized octopus chunks have turned something delicious into an abomination. 